Alright, so we're gonna do the Wikipedia search again. So let's get started. So, first of all, container. Should be no type. Uh, and blank. And search. Name this placeholder. Next, create a button. This button search. Then submit. And we'll create. <sighs> mm, that's pretty much it. And then we'll create a diff output. Div output. Cool. Control S. See, this is what I got for now. Um, I'm gonna do some CSS. I don't really feel like it. No CSS. Fuck it. Alright, so I got the HTML. CSS you can do it on your own. This is like a JavaScript tutorial. So, next we're going to add jQuery. Click Babel, add jQuery. Cool. Um, next. Okay. So, it's going to be. Or select search dot click should be on click create a callback callback that's a callback so when we click it we're going to store a search term Camel case. So we're gonna grab search term. Dot val. So we're gonna console log it to see what it spits out. Okay. Console. See, we're grabbing something. Cool. Okay, next we're gonna get the URL. Um, the URL should be in the exercise, so I'm just gonna copy and paste it. And the only thing you gotta change is the search term. So that'll be in between these two. So so it's a search between the quotes. So basically, um, I'm gonna open Notepad. So for example, copy and paste this right. So we're gonna delete the search term. Do a search term. Why not? Search for like puppies or something. Puppies. Pretend it's puppies. And we're gonna get a Ajax call. So we're gonna tab this. And we get puppies. It's pretty cool. We have all the information for us. Should get postman. Postman. Okay, got postman. Come on, postman. No, didn't get. So, let's do that. Cool. 
now we have all this stuff so this is the first array second array and third array so it's uh, 0 1 2 and is a nested array that this is gonna be puppies so this is the information for puppies this is the first array this is the description and we get basically links so it's a get so good for that Got it? Alright, cool. Next, we're going to create an Ajax request. So, let's go documentation, Ajax, jQuery, and look at it. Do the test HTML. Let's type in URL. A oh, URL like that, sorry. URL. Next, we're going to do function data. Console log data. Okay. Save. Okay. Okay. Nothing. So probably did that wrong. Okay, let's um let's passing an object lateral. So the first one is gonna be URL URL comma the type is uh get and async that's only false and data type is json uh, bad habit and for success we're gonna get function and we're gonna get three arguments. It's gonna be data, status, jqxhr, and we're gonna console log the data. Let's see if that works. Okay. There we go. We're getting something. That's all that matters. So, since we got something now, we're gonna comment that out. I should leave it in. Doesn't really matter. Matter. So it just comes along. So we can create a for loop. Bar i equals to zero, and i data one because data here. And then the array length of that should be like doesn't matter. You can do like zero or something because we're looping through all of them. So we're gonna put it on output. Outputs here the ID. So we're gonna plop it under the ID. output and we're going to prepend live HTML so I'm um, gonna copy and paste that you can copy and paste it too so I'll go over it. it's like a div and then we use wells and then data 3 in the first array is the title oh wait I gotta also install bootstrap then
we're good to go. So, we got all that. Now, we have to... Does enter work? Actually. Nope, enter does not work. Gotta click it. So, we have to create a function for enter now. So, So let's create that. So first of all, let's do search term dot key press function e, and we're gonna console log e, and we're gonna see the key presses through the console log. So let's go in here, console log. Okay, let's comp this out. And let's clear clear stuff. Clear. Okay. Okay, so we might need the problem. So instead, okay. So we want enter. So we want enter. Enter is thirteen. That's how you know what key it is. Ninety-seven, ninety-eight, or like whatever alphabets. So the key code is thirteen. So we want enter. So let's shrink this stuff out. So enter is 13. Okay, we got you. So if e key code equals triple equals to 13, we're just gonna copy and paste all this. And place it in here, and it should do enter. And then press enter. So done. So that's all I did. So uh, that's pretty much it. How to do this? So this is my redo of the tutorial. So I hope you learned something. Um, yeah, there's a lot of stuff like I didn't go over, but this is how I do it. There's probably a different way, but so I used like key press for enter because before it had just be all, like on click, but I created two functions. So like one for like if it hits 13, which is enter or return, and it'll show. So you just basically go, oh, I want to do this function again. Like please add all these informations to the bottom of the loop. It's like this is like all right. This is the URL. Grab me the URL from the third, the the the, the fourth array, the fourth item on the array, and then loop through every single one, and and then this is like the header. So this is the title from one, cause the console log from or the JSON from Postman. You can tell. You can look at it. So this would be grabbing the third one. See this one. And what the fifteen is zero. That's weird. It's like one, two, three. Apparently it does not count by zero on array. 
Oops. So let's get back to that. And yeah. So just learn how JSON works and uh that's about it. Bye.